You know, it'd be a fun game. I don't know if it'd be fun. I'd be too racist. <laughs> I'm waiting. <laughs> no, like, you know how your wife and other Indians have told us, like, they could just look at an Indian and tell exactly where they're from. Oh, sure. Right. Can't you now? Uh, get that, that, that's have a pretty I'm, good idea. I'm saying, what, let's say you get a non-stereotypical looking fella. Okay, then you you wouldn't be able to put your finger on it. Uh, that happens a lot. That happens with any Asian person. There's a girl on Dancing with the Stars right now, and you look at her and you think, is she Hawaiian? Is she Korean? Is she Chinese? So what? What are your what you what's your what's I just your think point it might, there? Like I don't know, it's a just, game like <laughs> turn it into an actual like I mean, a game. Obviously, if you have like a. A guy with sure. a guy with glasses eating fish, just shouting O's in the place. You just know it's a Bengali. Only a just, white man. Oh! Only a white man in America would come up with this game. <laughs> um, I think the I, think I got the, a great game, y'all. Let's look at pictures of people who are not white and see if we know what region of the world they come from. India. Look, that guy's got chopsticks. He's eating noodles. He's got to be a Japanese. Indi- Indian. I think the easiest might be Assamese. Because they're for sure. so it's unique. so unique. Granted, there's a lot of states but up there that I, have very similar, so that might be... Difficult. I vividly recall early on in, in my friendship with Indrani being so shocked at when I said, you can tell just by looking at somebody what part of India they're from? She said, oh yeah, absolutely you can. I mean, sometimes you can't because they may be somewhere in between, but you can definitively, there's someone who's from South India... And looks like South India. Well, yeah, I'm, I'm saying they the look specific South India. part, not being like they're from South India. Are they from Kerala? Are they from Canada? Are they from oh, Kerala? Are they know. from Tamil? Are they from that? I don't know that. That's, I, that's I, what I, I'm I, saying. The, the folks from that region could, yeah. I bet. Yeah, maybe. but even then, I bet you can't tell very much from uh, Tamil and, and Kerala. They're so similar and very in the it's a very similar part of uh, India. Yeah, but you can't. Because look, I mean, if we didn't know. Could you tell if Mamuts is is Malayali or if he's Tamil? No. No. No way. But you can tell. It's funny. Went back to New York with Ashley for the first time in her life. And everybody on her mother's side of the family is all blonde haired, blue eyed. Right. But everybody on my side of the family is like New York. If you're a native New Yorker, odds are you're going to be. Some combination of Italian, Jewish, and Irish. You're going to have dark hair, dark eyes. It's just standard fare. And so when Ashley got there, she was like, my people. <laughs> Look, it's my people. Josh. Hey, welcome back to our stupid directs of Corbin. How you doing? You can follow us on Instagram, Twitter, or juicy content. As little old mozzarella you says. Some patron folks How you doing? doing? Can you shut up? I love Lil Mo Mozzarella. Lil Mo Mozzarella. Oh, I love him. I love him. That is his official <laughs> name. Is that his official name? No, his, his real name is Mark, but that's his handle. And he is he is as New, New York Italian. He reminds me of my grandpa. He's way younger than, than my grandpa. I mean, my grandpa was that age at some point. But the way he talks is standard New York Italian guy, which is just, he, that's my grandpa. he has no chin. Who needs a freaking chin when you got a big heart? You can keep your chin. I'll take my heart. I'd rather have a big stomach and a full heart than a small chin and a stupid ace. He has no semblance of a chin whatsoever. <laughs> Here we go. How you doing? What oh, are we doing? Oh, yeah. Sorry. <laughs> He's just going to start the video. It's a new lyrical video from Kanguva. Kanguva. Uh, Surya. Bobby, ah! Bobby Duel. It's called... Uh, Talibani? Calm your mind with okay. chakra-based meditation music. Sarigama Karma Velvet. Sarigama.
phenomenal anthem. Seem like Ganguva has been coming out for a while. When is the release date? I think it said uh, November 14th. Hallelujah. Ganguva! That is one of my more highly anticipated films of the year. Ganguva! Everything, everything we've seen the about song that is, thing the song is especially. epic. Yeah. That is a fantastic. My biggest worry is it feels like anthem. They're, they're going with like a lot of uh, CGI. Yeah, but that was a lyric video. Uh, no, I've seen like the other stuff we've seen too as well. Um, so uh, that, that would be my only worry. But getting to see Surya, Bobby Duel, I'm sure Bobby Duel is the villain. Carthy. Carthy. Oh, just a cameo. Oh, just a cameo. Yeah. We just saw his, um, we just did a watch along of his film with um, Arvind Schwami, uh, the, the film that came out this year. It was called Start With an M. We loved. And it's a I mean, full watch along on Patreon right now. It's a uh, um, fantastic piece of cinema right there. Uh, One of the best of the year. I think I, I could be wrong. I think we've liked everything we've seen Carthy in. Yeah, we talked about that. We haven't seen a lot of a lot of his stuff, but, but what we've seen every, we've really everything liked. we've really enjoyed. I'm I, my expectations are very very of course Yogi freaking Babu and Prakash Raj. Prakash Raj. <laughs> of course, my, those my two expectations are, in it. are so high for this film because yeah. uh, everything I've seen, it just it oh it please be everything you look like you're gonna be. That was a great answer. What is that? An hour or two four two thirty. Yeah, that's, that's uh, two and a half. Oh, two and a half? Yeah. The original, so they changed the date. Yeah. Maybe that's why it seems like it's been coming out for a long time. Yeah. Um, Have you checked tickets? There's no way it's on. There's no way it's out um, for us yet. No, no, no. I didn't necessarily, but did it Did it show? On Fandango? Yeah, I'm going to look right now with you. Kanguva. There right. it is. Whoops. Hey, what did you do? Go back to Kanguva. You little stinkweed. Kangoo! Sorry, sticking, loading. Yeah, it's already. You can get tickets. Where? Why does it? What? AMC Burbank. Okay, yeah, AMC Burbank, starting November thirteenth. So it looks like AMC. So Regal. Cinemark by the Cinemark where we saw Patan. It's already. It's AMC's got a lot. It's got a lot of screens. Okay, good. So that's that's on the thirteenth. That's just AMC. So Regal right. Regal will drop at some point. But at least we've got AMC Burbank Town Center. Um, which I like that theater. I do too. That works. I mean, it works better for me than you. It's my neck of the woods. Yeah, but the, so, that's exciting. Duh. I'm excited. I'm very, what about you? Um, then comes out for us November thirteenth. Yeah. Good. Yeah, which is great because that means we get it the same day you do. Especially since we fall back this Saturday. Ugh! <laughs> One of the few times that I can remember I hate it. where we have voted for something and 70% of the people said, yes, change it. And our legislature said, no. We not only voted for it in California, they did it. Yeah. In the Senate. Yeah. It's, it's, it's amazing and to it me. It passed. We it's voted. Just sitting on the floor. We voted. Our votes clearly don't count. Because we voted for something, it passed dramatically, and the state of California went, don't think so, guys. Well, no, it's not exactly, it's more the federal, because even though we approved it, the federal government needs to approve. States' rights, <laughs> up yours. They 
the for, United States for that stuff. Those, your state needs to approve it, and then the federal government needs to approve it. We passed it. It was a beautiful law. We passed it. Everybody knew it was the good thing to do. Everybody knew it was great. I hope it's good. It'd be a oh, stars. I, I mean, so excited for this movie. Damo Cinema this year has been off the charts. Was he standing on burning dead bodies yeah. there? Yeah. Oh, that's so glorious. So what do we? We've only gotten the teaser, right, for this. Right? I believe that is right, which means we're now, we just entered November, so I expect a full-blown trailer. Or did we get the trailer? Tamil trailer. Did we two, get it? Uh, two months ago, so we're due oh, for another Oh, no. One. Give us a new trailer. Yeah, we'll get another one here in the next week. <sighs> I'm I so bet. excited. I bet that. we'll get that this week, I bet. Hope so. Because um, I remember that trailer, and it was really good. It looked really good. Please be good. Let's see. Reaction. Please be good. R should come up. No big deal. Um... Yeah. yeah, a couple months ago. Yeah, two months ago when yep. it first dropped. And it looks like we liked it a lot. From what I remember, it was good, but it was like two months ago. I had almost forgotten that it, this was coming out. Because I know. I'm guessing they ran into stuff. Who knows? Um, maybe they didn't want to compete with the Diwali stuff. Uh, maybe. They also could have said, we're not ready with our post-production. They also could have, as you know, with a lot of Indian films, the, you can have a... a, a you know, the stars are not aligning the way you want them to for that date. So there's a lot of reasons that could happen. Also, because certain films are coming out at certain times, there could be something else that is happening that one of the stars is involved in or the creators is involved in that you don't want to con. There's a lot of reasons. Anyways. But I'm glad to know. Hopefully it sticks. Uh, I mean, it's, it's in Fandango now for ticket sales. So let us know what you thought about it and anything else we need to know down below. Josh!